Hey guys, and welcome back to my Star Wars Battlefront guides. This is a hero guide on Han Solo. So we're going to go over Han Solo's abilities and how to play him in uh, general modes, such as multiplayer or in the uh, hero battles, such as what I'm going to show today. Uh, so his abilities are from the left, shoulder charge. The top is, I believe, his... Uh, it's a barrage type ability. And then the right bumper or uh, R1 on PlayStation is the lucky shot uh, so what we're gonna have here is uh, me playing against like I said on a normal hero battle uh, just to show off the abilities so I showed off the uh, shoulder charge there just to show what it did, did what it does the motion um, Han Solo is a ranged character of course as you can see um, he uses a DL44 blaster and uh, he's really fun to play, I have to say. As a, uh, as a fan of mostly the Jedi in any other game, I think Han Solo or Leia are actually my favorites in this game. Um, just because of the abilities he has, like Lucky Shot there is kind of like an explosive shot uh, that deals extra damage. Um, I, I really like that ability. Uh, just against, you know, in Heroes vs. Villains, because they can't block that shot. This here is, I believe it's called Hit Fire. And it's just unlimited shooting. It's like using the cooling uh, car, Y card in, uh, as a regular soldier. So he can use that, but the difference here as well is that he can fire as fast as he wants. Uh, so just like probably Leia and Boba Fett, you want to be kind of mobile with these characters. You don't want to stay in one spot because he's ranged. And also, you can't block blaster bolts. So if someone's going to hit you in the face, they're going to hit you in the face with a bolt. So it's very good to have cover, fire from behind cover, uh, use lucky shot on the bigger guys like I used it on the rocket guy right there, and um, be aware of your surroundings. Just like any other character, you always want to be aware of your surroundings. So I'm just running out here to grab the little tokens. It's not the best thing to do because it's out in the open, but because of the game mode I'm playing, that's how I beat it. Um, but yeah, so you want to use like charged or the lucky shot, excuse me, which is a charged shot on the bigger guys just to take them out in one hit, not to worry about getting damaged. Um, a shoulder charge will do damage, like right there, I just went right through them, uh, but you do have to hit them, you do have to make contact. Uh, I actually made a clip the other day that was pretty cool that got deleted where I ran through about four guys in Hero Hunt as Han Solo. It was pretty, pretty crazy. Um, it's a really good attack, but it's also good for escaping because if Darth Vader's hitting you, just like for any other character getting hit by Darth, it's, um, you have to use that to get away, otherwise you're going to die. Uh, so I used it again there to attack those guys. Uh, also has a melee. So Luke's melee is just his regular attacks. Um, I believe Leia has a melee as well. The only characters that don't have melees are the Empire um, and Luke, I guess, like I said. But yeah, so I used the hip fire there to fire on guys far away from me. It's actually very useful when you're firing down a hallway, um, a very thin area, because you don't even have to really aim at anyone. You just aim down the hallway. And if there's a lot of dudes, you just keep mashing that button and you keep hitting anyone. Uh, so there's a big guy right there. Just going to take him out with one shot. Easy. So I don't have to worry about him shooting me all those times. Like with that one, I took a lot of damage because I didn't have it. Uh, I could have used the hip fire, but I didn't. Uh, missile got me right there. I was kind of out in the open, but I'm going for health. So that was why I did that. Uh, Han Solo is really fun to play. You have to, like with all the other heroes, if you're playing Heroes vs. Villains, stay in cover with them. Uh, and I really recommend that if you're a ranged character, such as Boba Fett, Leia, or Han, you should really stick with Luke. If he's a smart Luke, anyways. If Luke just goes to their side and starts getting shot by everyone on their side, don't follow him, maybe. Uh, maybe just stay with your soldiers. But the reason for sticking with Luke most of the time is because he's going to be going up against Vader and attacking them immediately. So if they're trying to kill Luke, they have to be attacking and Emperor and Vader can't block if they're attacking Luke. So 
that means you use your lucky shark shark <laughs> you use your lucky shot to start do some heavy damage and also some damage to uh, most characters if they're all in a group and then you bust out the hip fire and start just mashing that button if you get multiple headshots on Emperor or on Vader, you can take him out within five seconds just by yourself. So if Luke's just blocking the whole time, you're perfectly fine. Uh, well, I mean, that's about it. Uh, I might do a hero guide later uh, discussing these characters some more. But as for right now, uh, phone, that's about it. So thank you for watching, guys. I really appreciate the views. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you really did, please click the like button. So people can see this, other people can see this video, and I can keep making more content because this is what I love to do. Uh, and also, if you want more videos, go ahead and subscribe down there. I'll be making hero guides for every hero, including any that come out for DLC. I'll also be making some general guides, such as maybe about the weapons or maps, things like that. So once again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all next time.